Hello guys, welcome back. On this video, I'm about to give you a gem. I'm about to give you an asset. An asset that's hard to get. This is very it has limitations to get to it. And I'm gonna get I'm gonna give you the tips to get this coin on this video. Now this coin is Pulse Chain. Okay, this is the native coin for Pulse Chain Network. Guys, in order to get a Pulse Chain Network is a hard fork of Ethereum. So that means that all your ERC20 tokens that you have on Ethereum, on your MetaMask, obviously, I encourage you, if you had MetaMask before May 13, before the month of May, you may have received the same amount of coins you have on your, as your ERC20 tokens on your MetaMask on the Pulse Chain Network, okay? So, one of the ways that I would highly suggest to get a hold of Pulse Chain, Pulse Chain has more tokens than Ethereum, of course. So it's faster throughput and low transaction fees than Ethereum by far. So one of the ways is for you to swap your duplicated copies that you got on the Pulse Chain network to Pulse Chain, okay? So if you have Ethereum, because obviously we all need Ethereum on the MetaMask wallet because your MetaMask, well, all the transactions are paid in Ethereum. So you will get, for that Ethereum that you had there, you have Pulse Chain, on, Pulse Chain coins on the Pulse Chain network. So first of all, you gotta go to PulseChain.com, abstract the RPC settings here, and um, add it to the, add it, you add the, this network to your MetaMask, and then you'll be able to see your Pulse Chain coins as your, as your Ethereum, on the Pulse Chain side, okay? To import your coins, I would highly suggest to use a, 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 a website that's called scanpulsechain.com, which is the explorer for Pulse Chain, okay? And the explorer for Pulse Chains, you could basically, if you want to see Aave's con a smart contract, just click Aave, click onto it, it'll pull Aave, Aave token. I would highly suggest to use the first one, try the first one, click onto it, make sure that you copy the address and then add it to the import tokens on your MetaMask under the Pulse Chain network settings, okay? If you do that, it may have, if you have like 100 Aave or 1,800 Aave on one side, on the Ethereum side, you will have that same amount on the Pulse Chain side as a PRC20 tokens. And then you could use to swap those coins, you would use appulsechain.com, appulsex.com. I'll be leaving links in the description below, in which you could end, you could also paste the address here on the on the search a token from the apples on, the, on this dex, um, and then you'd be able to pull up your uh, connected. Of course, connect the you know the this browser to your wallet, of course, and then you'll be able to see your balance on that coin on the exchange, on this DEX, okay? And then you may have to choose the bottom one, which is BPLS, and I'm sure you are familiar with the Central Exchange, I hope you are, because that's the world we're going, that's where cryptocurrency is going. So the first one would be to trade your PRC20 tokens for Pulse Chain. That's one of the first way. The second way would be to use the bridge. The bridge is called bridge.pulsechain.com, bridge and basically, you have to connect it to your wallet. It'll pull up how much Ethereum you have. And make sure that if you have Shiba Inu or any other coins that are below the 10th of rank in the Ethereum network side, to trade it for one of the for the biggest ones. Try to trade it for Ethereum. Try to bridge over USDC, DAI, some bigger top coins, ERC20 tokens. That because the liquidity pool, there may be insufficient funds on the post chain side. And you don't want to do that. Or they may not have pools that are available uh, in place already on the other side. That's something to take into note. To note that, make sure if you're going to bridge over, bridge over the top ERC20 tokens that you can in order for you to be able to have a good success uh, trading your um, your, ER, your wrapped ERC20 tokens for PLS. Because there may be pools available then so guys the the, four, the third way of getting pool chain is for you to go to coinmarketcat.com and under the markets there's about four centralized exchanges in which you can sign up and maybe even try to get it from there i don't trust these exchanges none of them but look how recent we are in this trend in this news that i'm telling you about i'm just launching this video right now where i'm seeing opportunities that you can make money as well um and i'm giving you this opportunity as well so okx 
exchange right now, there's around 941,000 liquidity volume traded being traded on that exchange. The second one would be safe trade. There's around 200,000 volume in trading that in that exchange. Ace bit. There's around 61,000. As ZT. Um, it, it is around $103,000 there. So there are a little bit of all, there's volume happening in these centralized exchanges, but most of the uh, action is taking place on the DEX, on the decentralized exchange, on app.pulsex.com. Now, now listen up. So now, the Pulse Chain has done 5.83x from four zeros, 274 to three zeros. One six, so that's a 5.83x. Ever since the bridge was connected on May 16, three days after the mainnet was launched, and like, um, so that's a that 5.83 percent uh, x is not is a lot, but it's not on cryptocurrency. That is that is probably pretty good, but it's not that great. Like, uh, there's coins that have done 20, 30, 40x, maybe even 100x in cryptocurrency. There's a lot of possibilities in which in real estate market or in stock market, you can't have. Um, the second coin that I will look into that I would probably want to uh, get a hold of will be Pulse X, which is the native coin for the, the central exchange, which uh, it did a 0.10x since it launched on May 16. It went from uh, five zero seven one three to four zeros six seven nine four nine eight, which is a point ten percent point ten x since it is inception. So this is a huge opportunity. The reason why this coin didn't do much x's as Pulse Chain did is because this there was two sacrifices. The first one was for Pulse Chain, and that took place on um, about a year and eight months ago which it was it was on august 2nd 2021 that's when it ended and then um and then probably about four to five months later the sacrifice for pools x happened so that means a lot of people that were that miss out the sacrifice for pool chain the sacrifice for pools x and then what took place is that when this uh main net took place all the sacrifices that that sacrifice for Pulse X traded their Pulse X for Pulse Chain, and that's why we see less X's on Pulse X. Okay, so the third coin that I will look into is the incentive token, which it did a 12.41x from 2.085 cents May 16 to 35 dollars and 37 cents. That's a 12.41x, and the incentive token has really done a good return another asset that has done a really good return would be pools dogecoin um which it went from seven cents to 91 cents that's a 13x guys this opportunity is here and i'm giving it to you you got to do further research you got to put your mind and work into it i'm trying to help you guys out i'm trying to help myself out and i'm being launching these videos to try to help you out to try to get a hold of this asset so number one would be to swap your duplicate copies that you have on Ethereum on your on your Pulse Chain network side. Number two would be to bridge over uh, using the bridge dot pulse chain dot com and your assets from Ethereum, the top assets of Ethereum, uh, through this bridge over to the Pulse Chain network and then swap them on pulsex dot com, guys. But make sure that you be patient with the bridge because think of the bridge as two big cities. Think of Ethereum as a city and think of Pool Chain as a city. And we have a bridge over this uh, between these two, uh, let's say, islands or, or cities. Um, and all the traffic from one city to the other are everybody wants to go to the Pool Chain. So when you have a lot of traffic, it, it, it would be a traffic jam. And so the transactions uh, to bridge over are very slow. Uh, right now, the estimate completion is about. 30 minutes um when i first did it it, it took about two days to be honest because there was so much transaction happening uh from uh ethereum to pool chain and so that's the second one the third one would be to look at the centralized exchanges that i just mentioned that are listed on coin market cap uh, on the pls of course on the pool chain uh there are there are four of them make sure you uh sign up make sure they're legit 
I don't trust centralized exchanges, especially these ones that are listed right now. And the huge opportunity is that right now, these are the only ways to get a hold of pools chain because it's not, it's not listed on Coinbase. It's not listed on Binance. So the, when the, when the, this to coin, it, it be available on these centralized exchanges, the liquidity of us dollars will be pouring in. If you get a hold of this asset right now, at this time, it would be very early for you to get yourself in. Many are saying that the prices that are on display right now is almost or near the sacrifice uh, dollar price that we sacrifice for. So make sure that you're doing your homework. Make sure you do further research. Guys, this is nothing financial advice, but this is a great opportunity for you to do some homework. And my videos are here to help you, to give you opportunities where you don't see them. Thank you for watching. Take care, guys. Peace out.